What is up, guys? Don't forget to subscribe. Follow me on Dreams. I am Young Text YouTube on Dreams. You can uh, follow me on Twitch. I'm Young Text on Twitch. If it said I'm streaming at the top, feel free to come into the stream. It should say it in a tab up here. There should be tutorials up here, like my 2D game tutorial, how to make 2D games, how to make fighting games, how to make combos in Dreams PS4, even home space tutorials. So look out for those. I don't have too many of those up yet, but they will be up. Um, you can check out my customized imp tutorial. I mean, it's pretty much right there. I think they made it more uh, prominent to see. I'll click that uh, later. Um, so yeah, this right here is the action recorder setting. Um, uh, if you want art tutorials, check out my channel playlist, click on my channel name, then go to the playlist for those tutorials. Um, it should be on my channel or playlist, then you can easily find that stuff, how to make games, stuff like that. So, near the end of this video, I'll show you a game that I'm actually making. It's a fighting game. There's like 15, 14 characters, so on. Let's get into this. Let's get into this. So, the action recorder is under anime. It is not keyframes. Keyframes is how you would record things um, um, by frames. By frames. So, one frame, two frame, three frame. Action recorder is pretty much recording um, your movements with the imp your movements with the imp if your imp is uh, hovering above something so that's what that's for you can make some really cool um things doing it to give you just the gist of it it can do things like this so now if we were to press play here's the settings options and usually you want to press this on once and usually i take off the keep changes option so right here, uh, expand the range. So this right here is for like how you would get platforms and stuff to move. That's prominently what you use this for. Of course, you can use keyframes for that also, and it can be a little bit easier because with keyframes, you can do it in a way that it's like a grid snap movement, like a grid snap movement. To do that with the action recorder, you would have to go to um, grids, You'll probably have to turn on precise move or the grid snap setting. Stay up right, one of these. Turn on studio lighting to make everything lit up. That won't be like that in your actual game. So that's pretty much uh, that. But you can also, let's say you were trying to use action recorders on a character, on an actual character. There's some cool things you can actually do. This is not how you should animate characters. You should animate characters with keyframes. But if you were to press L1 and X and get the purple marquee thing at the bottom here, then you can action record the limbs and stuff precisely. You should be able to. You can do that. Whereas if you were to do it while you weren't scoped in like this and to scope out well, you just press this it'd be more of um something like this you could scope in and you should be if you're touching the base of it like i'm doing now while you're scoped in it'll like you know do those kind of movements um we can see what that is like So if you scope in and you hold the base, then it'll take it above the, um, the purple marquee won't move with it, if that makes sense. So this right here is actually where the hitbox is, the purple marquee. And you can find that hitbox by pressing L1 and square. You can check out my hitbox tutorial for fighting games. This is a different type of built-in hitbox that I use for wall detection, um, specifically in my games. So that's that hitbox. But this is how you record with the action recorder setting. Don't forget to subscribe, follow me on Dreams and whatnot. And that's pretty much, um, you can do some really quick edits with that. It can be for facial animations. That might be the type of thing you want to use for facial animations and stuff like that. I believe that this right here might become more useful in the future. As of right now, keyframes is pretty much how you would, um, I want an axe, do this. And if you were to put that keyframe in the timeline, and you can check out my keyframes tutorial, then you can pretty much keep on stacking keyframes. 
as long as the keyframe set to linear you can usually only put it on linear in a timeline and um you can get some more specific animations uh, the animations that you would see for robot chicken that's how you would do this kind of stuff or at least should at least should um again i think this will become more prominent in the future record possession can be really useful because that right there can be used um to quickly record the possession as if you know you play as your character and it'll record those movements as you're playing it as a game so that's what that's for you can turn on mic on off you can mess with that as you please as you please so this is the action recorder tutorial don't forget to subscribe we're gonna go ahead and check out the game that I'm working on and I hope you guys enjoy it check out my fighting game tutorials um, if you guys want to learn how to make fighters like this, I'm just going to open up a character that, um, you know. So, I'm usually using, um, to make my fighting game, I'm using people's creations, the most uh, popular ones that people can recognize and some of the cooler ones that people can recognize. This right here is a really cool game, really cool game, um, at least in my opinion. And you can go through planes like that. And right now I have a working CPU. Really cool stuff that I'm doing here for the Dreams community so that everyone can see that this kind of stuff is possible. I'm also working on a first person shooter. Also working on a first person shooter. I have tutorials for that and stuff like this in my channel playlist. Or if you need to learn how to uh, release games, I even have basic tutorials like that so this right here is the action recorder tutorial the action recorder tutorial i hope you enjoyed it don't forget to subscribe follow me in dreams i'm young text youtube check out my channel playlist for interviews or on logic sculpting animation music and more and follow me on twitch i'm young text on twitch peace out guys i hope this helps and i hope you guys have a marvelous 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 day dreaming dreams all that great stuff and i hope my tutorials or somebody else's teach you guys how to use dreams ps4